This is a safe tack two horse slant bumper pull by Double D Trailers. We are at the Double D Trailer factory. I'm going to take just a few moments to point out some of the features of the safe tack. This is a neat little trailer. I really like it. Let me just give you a quick walk around here. You can see the aerodynamic front or the aerodynamic nose works well for towing. It really cuts through the wind. Of course you have a sliding window on the front. You can get some airflow through. Safety chains. Nice safe coupler. Sidewind jack. Operates easily with one hand. We have diamond plating all across the front and up here for rock guards so you don't have to worry about rocks dinging up your trailer in the future. This is this is a trailer built with the Z-Frame technology. It's a non-rusting frame. It's very durable. Much stronger than a conventional aluminum frame that we offer. Uh, the drop down window at the horse's head side it has a mid-latch system. Mid-latch means that it's not up top. It's midway. So you can reach it easier. Apologize for the noise. The bars and the windows fold independent of each other. So you can lay the bar down, fold it back up, travel in that position, or you can lift the window as well. And this window will slide. It has a sliding function. We have a tie loop for each horse. And of course on Safe Tack you can choose the style of graphic that you want as well as the color that's all included in the price. Um, I like the running board that's on either side of the trailer that runs front to rear. That's an aluminum running board. We use this uh, fender trim so there's not any sharp edges anywhere so you can cut your hand or have injury to your horses. Aluminum fender. Aluminum fenders are easy to replace. Maybe we shouldn't talk about replacing, but unfortunately tires go flat from road debris. Once that happens, fender damage occurs, so it's easy to replace these fenders. They're simply bolted on. Now, if we take just a moment to look in the dressing room, you'll notice that this is not a conventional camper door with a screen. This is a factory built door made uh, at our Double D factory here. We have a window installed. And one thing that I want to point out about this door is I always like to give our, our doors the knee test. If you're looking at other trailers, just walk up to the doors and put your knee against it and pull a hand up top here and just really pull on that door and see what happens. And, uh, most of those you can warp. And of course this actually sounds and feels like the door when you open and close it. And we have a tie back on all doors, really solid and secure latch so you don't have to worry about the wind slamming your door around while you're trying to operate out of your dressing room. I like these windows because they allow for a lot of light to come through. You'll notice the dressing room roof is completely insulated all the way around. There are not any wires exposed whatsoever. Everything is trimmed nice and neat as it should be. Of course you have a, a, a dual light inside. Once you step in you can just reach over and flip the switch and turn that light off or on. The spare tire we have located inside the dressing room. We can put it in the room or outside. That's your choice. I personally like them inside so they don't get stolen. Uh, rubber stall mat in the floor. We offer carpet. My preference is the rubber mat. Uh, the problem I have with carpet is it tends to soil up quickly and uh, you can't clean it after a few months of use. You just end up with really nasty carpet. And of course with a stall mat you could literally hose this out. Uh, just pull the mats up and, and hose it right off if you want to. We have a 2x8 pressure treated pine floor underneath and the water will escape through the floor. Uh, walk through door from the dressing room to the horse area is standard on all Double D trailers. This particular customer that purchased this trailer added some additional bridle hooks inside and uh, we've got that here. They also added an optional sliding screen door which I really like. And what happens here is you can 
slide this door over and hook it or you can also open it up like so and leave it in the open position. We call that a retractable screen door so that it's out of the way. Now I want to walk around